Good morning. Thanks for joining us on Denver 7 News at 11. I'm Molly Hendrickson. This weekend, Colorado will remember Elijah McLean. The 23 year old died after Aurora police used force, detaining him on his walk home and calling for paramedics to sedate him using ketamine. Monday marks one year since that violent encounter that led to his death. But McLean's family is canceling events this weekend. Denver 7's Micah Smith shows us the pain his mother has and how violence over her son's death is making it worse. No justice, no peace. Violence and disappointment. Demonstrations demanding justice for Elijah McLean have often ended this way. And Elijah McLean's mother, Shanine McLean, says She's tired of it. Personally, I, I don't want Elijah's name on it. During a Facebook Live with Aurora activist Candace Bailey, Shanine McLean said she will no longer support events that use her son's name without her permission. Shanine and I will be the only ones who will ever entertain anything with Elijah's name ever again. Um, there, we're not going to endorse someone else to do something. Friends of the family say Shanine has two major concerns. Activists using her son's name for their own purposes. This is not a place to come speak and talk about anything about you. And the Aurora Police Department's violent response to demonstrations. Aurora has made clear that not only would they murder Elijah, they would never ever fire the police. They would never charge them with anything. City Council Representative Allison Coombs agrees more should be done. As I've said many times, um, we have to be talking about dramatic change, not just nibbling away at the edges of the problem. Shanine says while she fights for justice for her son, on the one year anniversary of Elijah's death, she will celebrate his life with friends, family members, and other mothers who have lost children to police brutality, while also promoting Elijah's message of peace in a place where there's been so much violence. Reporting in Aurora, Micah Smith, Denver 7. Candace Bailey says she is planning an event with McLean's mother for Sunday evening, and she'll release details about that event later today.